Got some different work colleagues, which is always interesting. So he's my work colleague at the moment. What are you making for us? Food and bread. And Joyce is doing her maths homework. That's our life. currently having a little bit of quiet time because I'm about to get onto a call. One of our favorite escapes uh, after the morning work for our daily exercise is to come to Bushy Park, just get you out of the house after having been sort of headphones on your ear, uh, homeschooling the kids, doing their work. We're back on all our sites at the moment, um, which is really good news. We've used the construction leadership guidelines as a template to work out how we get on site. First of all, we always consider, are people ready to come back to the site they want to? Is anyone in the vulnerable group? Have they got any family members they need to look after? We've then looked at how people travel to get to site. Once we get to site, we've gone through in detail how we can move around safely. We've gone through our welfare facilities in great detail. And then when we look at the actual tasks that people are doing, we've cut down the number of people we need to do on a task. And in a lot of cases, we've reduced the tasks we're doing. But where we are having to use masks, we're not using the ones that the NHS use uh, to avoid the burden on the NHS. So we've done an awful lot of work to get people back on site. Hi, I'm Harry Rudd, site engineer based at Carmel Road Riverside. We've developed a series of measures to protect our workforce and local community during the COVID-19 pandemic. Developing a one-way system in the office and on site, reducing the need for hand scanners, installing additional hand wash stations, increased PPE and mask cleaning stations. Protecting our canteen and store staff with separation barriers. Staggered shifts with a reduced shift rotor and minimised office workers with only essential personnel required on site. Due to the corona pandemic, we've had to make a lot of adaptations to site. We have put in a one-way system onto site, so you only access the site in one direction and ex exit the site in another direction. If people do need to work in close proximity, they will be wearing masks at all times. Where we have removed lockers to give a clear space with markings on the floor of two meters to make sure everybody understands the distances they've got to keep to each other. I'm very confident that the work the teams are doing out there is good, it's safe uh, and we're constantly reviewing it and getting the feedback from the teams. <laughs>